सो हेलो गाइस वेलकम टू मैकेनिकल डिजाइन ऐप प्लीज सब सब की सब्सक्राइब दिस चैनल फॉर मैकेनिकल डिजाइन रिलेटेड सॉलिड वर्क सॉलिड एज एंड डिफरेंट मैकेनिकल डिजाइन सॉफ्टवेयर रिलेटेड ट्यूटोरियल वीडियोस सो लेट्स गो टू आवर टॉपिक इन द थंबनेल यू कैन ऑलरेडी नो व्हाट वी आर गोइंग टू डू टुडे वी आर जस्ट मेकिंग ए सॉलिड एज ड्राफ्टिंग टेम्पलेट ऑफ ए फोर uh size template okay so first you have to go for to the new option then go for the new and select asymmetric and asymmetric and select the asymmetric draft okay so you can see that by default solid edge have given this sheet one okay if you see the backgrounds of the different type of uh, page that is uh, a, a page a4 page a3 page a page b that will be shown here we i am just going to uh, uh, showing that that in the view option if you select this background you can see that play um, sheet a sheet b sheet c sheet d this is the dimension of the standard sheet okay so in this video we are going to make uh, a4 uh, sheet uh, layout or a4 sheet uh, drafting template so we are just go make the a4 sheet drafting template in sheet 1 okay so if you come here and just cl uh, click the right uh, right click on the mouse you can see that insert option so when you click insert you can see that one background has been come that is completely blank so first we have we are just going to uh, rename this so first click and rename give the a4 a4 horizontal okay click here the a4 horizontal when we are just give its space size give the sheet scale uh, or sheet setup give it a4 white okay a4 white the default uh dimension 297 into 210 and click here okay so you can see that you are we have just make the default a4 size in horizontal or uh horizontal position okay so here we have to make the uh layout so go for the a sheet option you can see here also by default solid edge had make this template so we are just copy that part uh, first select the whole part then click the control plus c after coming here just press control plus v you can see that the thing has been come here okay you can see the, this now what we can do if we just uh, want to um, uh, position these uh, nameplates and other things rightly we have to just click these uh, edges and make it delete okay wait we have just make it delete these two part then what we can do just select select the whole part and select the select the whole part one second select the whole part and go for here move option you can go and just set here here okay after going here you just select this and go for the move option you can set this here 
now what you can do you can select this also go for the move option select this here okay now select this edge go for move option and place this here okay now you have to give one line here just we are making one vertical line as a border we can extend this line we can extend this line to this extent okay. also like this we can extend this line here we can make one line also here okay we have make that line and we are extend this line also to this part okay now we are just make one line here okay now time for the trim option select the trim option and trim all these parts select these two part and trim here so you can see that we have made the this part if you like to change something in the nameplate you can change here see here we are just giving the mechanical design hub uh, we can give the dimension or the scale lower so that it can fit you can edit and delete this part unnecessary writings you can change all of this part okay so in this way you can see that this is the a4 uh, horizontal page and we are just making this nameplate here okay so for the a4 vertical what we can do just go here select insert you can see that another has come so go here rename a4 vertical okay okay now go select the sheet setup go for a4 tall select this you can see that okay now what we can do just go for here select this whole template control c come and control v you can see that we have done it now like the previous we are just making the two boundary delete these two part delete select the whole part and move to this select this move this part and i am just deleting these two line okay now i am just making some two line here uh, you can see the two lines here that is vertically like this i'm just extend 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 or move this part okay i can make one line here up to this part 
I can make one line also here up to this part. For this, we can just move it. I can just move it we can just give one line here <coughs> we can give this line here you can see that okay after <coughs> making the all boundaries we are just trimming all these things okay this is how <coughs> this is how we are just make two a4 horizontal a4 vertical part okay so for the sheet option to make it activated in the sheet part you have to <coughs> select this form go for the sheet and you have to go for the sheet scale oh, sorry go for a sheet sheet setup go for background a for horizontal you can see that this is the for horizontal when <coughs> you want to uh, drawing something in a4 vertical go for the sheet setup for a4 vertical so i am just uh, bringing of one assembly drawing view here how can we go go for the view wizard select this assembly drawing and automatically the view has been come go for the principal view option select this one view and select this part view okay so you can bring the view also so select this and change the part you can see these automatically changes you can bring other options like control and select this you can bring it and give it the isometric view how can you give you can select this the isometric view and you can give the shaded option also select shading option in the you can give the shading option update view you can see that the shading option when you just change in the a4 horizontal see we are making the uh, uh, sheet in uh, a4 uh, vertical in sheet one select the background default background to a4 vertical we could change these here when you can change here 88 eight something save or just leave it 88 eight. When you go for the sheet, you can see that automatically change here. So in sheet one, you can change or uh, select any type of uh, uh, sheet background uh, that are the backgrounds you can uh, bring and uh, generate uh, drafting uh, drawing in these sheets. And you can select this background by sheet setup background and select this. Okay, this is the video. In the upcoming videos, we are going to show all these things, how to give annotations, how to give automatic dimensions, part list, whole table, bend table. Keep watching these videos and like and comment and uh, please comment what type of videos you are just looking for in my channel. Thank you all.